We are now done solving the first two layers of the cube and we're going to jump into solving the third layer. The third layer is mainly solved by using algorithms and there are three ways the cube can look or the third layer can look right after you're done solving the first two layers. So as you can see we have a dot right here and a uh, mirrored L, so a normal L would be like that, but it's mirrored. And then we have a straight line. And they're ordered in difficulty, I guess you could say that. Um, so we're actually gonna be using one algorithm to make the cube look like a cross, as you can see in this cube. So we have a cross right here. So yeah, let's jump into it. Right now we have the um, dot so the dot is actually the, the worst case that you can get to make that final cross up here um, to do that you actually have to do this algorithm three times and the algorithm goes like this F R U R prime U prime F prime so you could have done that anywhere on the dot because obviously it stays there um, and then you get an L, so you get to the second step, which um, was what we talked about. So the L has to look like a mirrored L before you do it. So a normal L would look like this. So you just have to keep turning the top until it looks how you want it to be, or just rotate the cube. And yeah, if, when it looks like this, you execute the algorithm, which is the same one that we just did, which is F. Oop. So it would be F, R, U, R prime, U prime, F prime. And then we go into the straight line. So from the straight line, we do the same algorithm again. And that straight line has to be horizontally um, in front of you. Um, so not like that, like that. And then F, R, U, R prime, U prime, F prime. And now we have our cross. So like we, like I said before, when we were solving the cross um, in the bottom, um, don't worry about the corners. We're not really worried about them right now. We're just worried about getting this cross, but that's how you do it. If you're trying to get a little bit faster on that step, there is an algorithm that you can do to skip from the L to the cross. And that's just one more algorithm you have to memorize. And yeah, it's not really that hard. It's pretty much kind of the same as before, but just slightly different. It's actually an F and instead of an R, we actually do a U, R, U prime, R prime, F prime. And we skipped straight from the L to the cross without having to go through the line. And so you can do that to skip over to this. If you need to, if you don't want to memorize that algorithm, that's fine. You can still be pretty fast with um, using the other algorithm. Um, yeah. yeah. So just have to get used to moving the cube. But yeah, that is the cross for the third layer.